Who wouldn't want their very own indoor shooting range inside their own home? Well, here's how you can. Welcome everyone, I'm Perry Yee with Fortified Measures, your one-stop shop for personalized home defense, where we actually bring practical training to your doorstep to help teach you how to defend your home and your family against any type of home invasion scenario. All right guys, so before we jump in, we would love it if you would leave a comment down below and make sure to leave a thumbs up on the video. And if you would, please consider subscribing to the channel. Don't forget to hit that notification bell so that you get notified every time we drop a new video. All right, so we are gonna be starting a new video series here that's gonna cover a bunch of different training tools that I use in my personal life, as well as with my clients as far as dry fire practice goes. All of the products we're gonna be reviewing are from a company called Laser Ammo. Laser Ammo makes a laser-based training tool that is, um, gives you a more realistic and practical application when it comes to training with your firearms inside your own home. For the past couple of years, I have spent a ton of money as far as research and testing out a bunch of different training options for dry fire use. And with all the different brands that I did find, there are a ton of good items that I actually still use today within my practice, but it was hard to find the total package when it comes to the proper weapon setups and compatible targeting systems. So once I found laser ammo and saw the wide variety of products that they offer, I was able to put together what I believe are some of the best options as far as dry fire practice goes. Um, as a disclaimer, all of the tools that we're gonna be reviewing here within the next few videos, I did purchase myself except for the CQB targets, which are the standing silhouette targets back here. Um, Laser Ammo was generous enough to send those out for review and testing, which we're gonna cover more in depth here in the third video of this series. Also down below in the description, I'm gonna leave some affiliate codes so that you guys can get a discount on all of the Laser Ammo products. I do get a kickback from those affiliate codes, which do go towards um, helping to build up this channel. So let's talk about dry fire practice and why it's so crucial to your firearms training. First up, safety. With dry fire practice, it greatly reduces the risk of any type of bodily harm since there's no live ammunition involved. This can allow you to focus more on the fundamentals of handling your firearms, such as your grip, your trigger control, your side alignment, your reload drills, etc., without the inherent dangers that are associated with any type of live fire exercises. So ultimately, with dry fire, you can build and reinforce the foundation of your shooting. Plus you can do it from the comfort of your own home. All right, and up next is muscle memory. Get those reps in guys. Repetition is key as far as muscle memory goes. With a dry fire practice, it does allow you to repeatedly work on your fundamental movements and actions that can ultimately enhance your performance and your speed once you do transition over to live fire exercises. Dry fire practice allows for more cost effective training. Let's be honest, the cost of ammunition is expensive, and plus when you're adding frequent visits to the range, now you're dealing with range fees, having to deal with range staff, which is never fun, and also paying for transportation. So all that together might not always be feasible. So with dry fire practice, it gives you a more cost-effective alternative where you can train more regularly without the use of live ammunition and with less trips to the range. That being said, you might have to spend some money up front as far as the training tools go, but after a couple uses, they're gonna pay for themselves. And lastly, there is stress management. While dry fire obviously isn't gonna produce the same amount of stress that you're gonna get with a life-threatening situation, it will, however, be able to help a shooter become more comfortable and composed with handling a firearm, especially a novice shooter. You might not wanna take a first-time shooter to a live fire range. It's not the best place to learn, in my opinion. It's gonna be loud, which makes it harder to communicate any type of instruction. They're gonna be more focused on what's going on around them instead of focused on the application itself Plus they're gonna be around other shooters, which is a risk in itself where you don't know the competency level of the person in the next stall. Plus with a new shooter, you're gonna be faced with a level of fear that they're gonna have just being around live ammunition in general before they're actually comfortable and confident with how to handle a firearm properly. All right, so now that we have hammered home the importance of dry fire practice, let's get back to the focus of the series and that's gonna be the training tools themselves. Over the next few videos, we're gonna be talking about the target systems that I use, my pistol setups, and my rifle setups. All are gonna come with a list of pros and cons, but hopefully by the end of the series, you guys are gonna see what's gonna work best for you in whatever application that you see fit. All right, in the next video, we're gonna be covering the IMITS targets. Those are these small little interactive targets here that come equipped with six different training programs. 
These are a ton of fun. They are actually the first targets that I ever got. Um, obviously you can see the size. They're very small, very portable. You can stick them in deep corners. You can put them in small crevices along the house. What's great about that is if you are limited on your training space, you can fit a ton of these in one small area. They're not big. They don't take up a lot of room. There's times when I'll be in my dining room and I'll set them up along the wall work on some pistol drills and do some drawing, things like that. Um, or if you are doing any type of close quarters maneuvering, doing any type of home defense training, they're great because you can sync up a ton of these and put them all along the house and you have an awesome indoor or outdoor training arena, even if you want to take these out into your yard. All right, after that, we're going to be going over the CQB in a box setup. Once again, those are these standing silhouette targets behind me. They're pretty new to the laser ammo lineup, but they have quickly become my personal favorite piece of gear in the entire setup. They are super lightweight. The set is gonna come with three targets and three tripods as well. The tripod mounts are gonna swivel, which is pretty convenient for when you wanna put them behind barricades or behind or peeking behind a wall or anything like that. It does come with three different light up zones that can be programmed to work together as a unit or they can be programmed to work as three individual zones. You can change the colors of all the different target zones and you can actually program the amount of shots that it takes to wipe out each one of the target zones or all of them together as a unit. All right, moving on to the pistol setups. The first thing we're gonna discuss is the recoil enabled training pistol from Laser Ammo. I love this thing. They are replicas of real firearms. So depending on the type of brand that you like to use on your own time, chances are they're gonna have one that's gonna be comparable to what you normally use. They do offer blowback, so when you're training, you get recoil, so it's a little bit more fun and engaging and a little bit more realistic feel when you're training. After that, we're gonna talk about the Sure Strike pistol cartridge, which is a simple nine millimeter size cartridge that fits in your actual firearm. Uh, they do have conversion kits available if you happen to run a 40 or 45 as well. All right, lastly, we're gonna talk about rifle setups. First, we're gonna discuss the flash bolt system. The flash bolt is a battery operated laser bolt that goes into your own AR platform. What's great about that is now you can train with your actual AR setup and have continuous trigger pull. Next, we're gonna talk about the flash kit adapter, which is a laser head that gets mounted on the front of any gas powered airsoft rifle. What's great about that is now you can train with some recoil and have a little bit more realism, but both are gonna be perfect options for rifle as far as your indoor training goes. All right, everyone, that is a quick rundown of just some of the many different dry fire products that Laser Ammo has to offer. Please join us in the upcoming videos. We're actually gonna be breaking all these down one by one and helping you put together your perfect indoor range setup. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you guys hit the like and subscribe button below and make sure to turn on your notifications so that you guys get notified every time we release a new video. I right, appreciate it. Catch you next time.